So bone is assuming it's in the correct spot. Obviously, if you have a fracture and it's displaced, that's gonna be a different story. But if the bone is in the correct spot, the muscles pulling on the bone actually give it the ability to heal itself. Muscles, as long as they're not completely ruptured, they can knit back together, but they will form scar tissue initially. That's how our body heals. The first stage is forming that scar tissue. So then we have to be able to get for a muscle, the contractile elements, so contraction and relaxation, so that it doesn't end up scarring down and creating an abnormal tone. So there's normal tone in our muscles, that's what keeps us sitting upright, <laughs> but there's abnormal tone and that's that tension that really like pulls into the shoulders. Discs are also another thing that are actually able to heal themselves. And it's super interesting because discs are like a Chinese finger lock in that their fibers go in different diagonal patterns. Some of them are up and down, but the outer ones are in more diagonal patterns. So discs actually get their nutrition, much like a sponge, through rotation. So if you rotate to one side, that kind of squeezes all the waste products out. And as you derotate or come back to neutral, that sucks in all the nutrition that's around it. 